trying out some beautiful, beautiful wallets and turning them into walks, right? Wallet on chain with this beautiful, wonderful insert by Samoga, okay? And I'm gonna show you how to do some DIY. Um, yeah, and this is not a sponsored video, by the way, just me sharing some good tips and a great deal to all of you, my fellow sisters, on how to get that perfect walk for a budget. So let's start. What shall we start off with? So, okay, so I've been doing some shopping on the pre love market recently and um, I needed to get, because this insert by Samoga fits um, the Emily wallet or the Sarah wallet by Louis Vuitton and also the, the long wallet from Chanel. And um, so I needed to get myself some pre-love bargains and special finds to get that wallet and chain for a budget, right? On a budget. So I went and you can look um, at my previous video. I will put that link down below in the description box on how I scored this beautiful Epi Leather Sarah wallet from LV by LV um, on the pre-love market for a very, very good deal. So we're gonna start turning her into a walk. She will be my first project, okay? And um, for all of you out there, I have kept all these beautiful, um, you know, and um, accessories from my other bags and also purchased some, um, you know, recently you know when you see some bag change or bag straps that you know speaks to you but most of my collection that i have on you know in display here yes you can see them all right they are just most of them from previous bags that i own or currently own and i'm just reusing them multi-purpose kind of thing so what do we do so what we do first is that we just basically open the wallet okay and we have to insert the Samoga insert into this area, the tight, tighter area, the tighter uh, blue pocket, okay? Not, not on these, not in these sides. So let's start with the Samoga. I got this in black with the silver hardware to match um, the silver hardware of this wallet. But I did order more recently um, with Samoga for other colors, the LV beige, the LV black, and uh, a few others, okay? So that I could use them for all the wallets that I have here. So let's start with the basic black. So we just pop it into this really tight um, pocket here, right? Okay, and fit it in nicely. And you can choose basically any kind of strap because once you click it, all right, um, this, this will be sticking out the little uh, hardware from the insert. So you click up your wallet and um, for today, let's start with a chain. So because I chose the, um, the silver hardware, I am going to go with a standard silver chain, all right? To complement this um, insert and this wallet. So let's start with that. And this is very standard, you know, standard wallet and chain. And later on, I will show you how to spice up some of your pretty, pretty wallets, okay? With other kind of chains and other ideas. So there you go. So this is a very standard wallet and chain, as you can see, all right? Okay, it's very nice and very handy. So this cost me basically maybe less than 200 US dollars. And if you buy a wallet and chain from Louis Vuitton, it would cost you probably more than a thousand US dollars. So, okay. So if you want to spice it up, you know, with other kind of um, accessories, you can too, right? Um, I maybe would like to change this if I wanted to go for a nice evening with a pearl strap, right? So then it will 
look more elegant and uh, yeah I could use this um, for something dressier or you know whichever you fancy really correct so look how pretty that is wow right so there you go and instantly you have something trendy and very very elegant and pretty so Okay, so we're done with this wallet. Let's start with another wallet. So these are just two ways. I have many, many straps to complement the many, many um, wallets that I have on display here today, right? So I'm gonna take the insert out. And uh, okay, let's start mix with this beautiful one from LV as well. And this is by Tehashi Murakami. Um, and this is the multicolor um, series made in manufacture in the early 2000s, right? And this actually is a little find that I also got on the pre-love market recently. And um, yeah, let's turn her into something very pretty. And yeah, I'm going to, okay, because she is the having the gold hardware. I'm gonna use the Samoga insert with the gold hardware, all right? You can see it's gold, okay? And um, just to compliment, I did order a beige one for my daughter. This wall is gonna go to my daughter, so I did order a Samoga beige um, that will be coming, arriving shortly. So what do I do? I'm going to put this Samoga insert into this area. I guess you could use it on either area, but let's try here. Okay. Um, you could use it in this type, type nook, this type section here, or um, perhaps here as well. So, okay. So let's buckle her up. And, um, okay. For this particular piece, I could use a, you know, um, the leather strap also from another bag of mine from Louis Vuitton to complement it. Um, this is what I'm going to try today. And um, yeah, let's try her out. Um, yeah, sorry, my fingers are, <laughs> my nails are a bit long, so it's a bit hard to get that, that um, the thing, the, the little clip, clippy thing in right so let's try her um yeah so we need to get that so for all of you who love wallet on chains as much as i do this is a wonderful wonderful way on a budget but also looks very very expensive and very classy so look i've just turned this little wallet this um sarah wallet and turned her into a wallet on okay maybe this is a wallet on strap <laughs> so look how beautiful it is right okay yeah so and if I wanted to I could also turn her um, a little bit more classy or more vibrant with a gold chain so I thought that you know because of the beautiful colors that she has, this wallet has. I'm gonna use this gold chain that I have from another bag of mine um, to complement her. And this beautiful chain has little um, colorful stones to match. Look how pretty it is. It has, you know, the, um, the, the red, the ruby, sapphire color. I don't know why this is a bit stuck, but okay, I need to adjust her. Um, citrine this is like an emerald green okay so i could use her to complement this the chain and this wallet this uh, kabuki sorry not kabuki this um, murakami wallet to complement okay oh okay because can you see that it's a bit um you know small the ring so you can also buy little rings the rings from Simoga for like about six US dollars. Um, okay, the inserts are actually um, 14 US, I think, and they, these are uh, little rings that you can complement um, 
with the inserts because sometimes you know you can see it's a bit tiny and if you want if your your, your loop buckle is a little bit um, you know thicker the hook it will not go in so I've just attached it to this all right can you see I've attached it to the Samoga insert so now that can you see how massive this hook is so it can now go in and yes I have bought also, okay these d-rings do come in silver or gold uh, unfortunately the gold hasn't arrived yet I did order so I'm gonna use the silver today um, just for you to see because I was so excited to get this video filming and if I were to wait for my shipment from Samoga it would take another month okay so Let's try it. Let's try it this way because so that you can see the stones. So look how pretty that is. Okay, I'm not sure why it's a bit tangled. I have to get it untangled, but yeah, this is the gist of it. All right, so look how gorgeous. Yeah, <laughs> I love it, and I'm pretty sure my daughter will love it too. So um, I'm showing you all the different different ways you can turn your wallets to um you know wallet on chains that will suit your need right or you know your fashion style for that day and that's the beauty of it when you can interchange and swap and change with your accessories so that's why i love it so this wallet mix is by uh, lv as well as the kabuki uh, range so these are limited editions right um and this one was you know yeah, manufacturer I think in 2018 or something and um, so I will also turn like just pop pop it into the, the, the insert here again so to put it inside and let's see what I can do with her today so all right let's let's do something a little bit different I am going to use this little chain strap okay so let me remove this d-ring because i only have one set of d-rings um the thing is when you have long nails everything becomes very cumbersome when you try to play with all these little nitty-gritty stuff but nonetheless very very rewarding um you know when you get them all done up and pretty so let me get this in to there Oh gosh, with my glasses and the long nails, <laughs> it gets a bit tedious and difficult, but fun. So I am going to try you it with a shorter chain first, okay? So I've done it with two D-rings and um, let's hook this in. Okay, I think this one should fit. Let's try. Yes, it does. It does fit. So voila, now I have a, a shorter wallet on chain, okay? And this one, you can just loop it around your arm like so. How cool is that, right? And if I wanted to turn this um, short strap into something longer, I could pair it with a uh, leather strap. Okay, I'm gonna try with this leather strap okay and see how she goes or another chain strap so let's try her with this leather strap and uh, see how this beauty goes alrighty <laughs> it's funny when you, when you play with all these goodies I love playing with my bags and my you know with all the different different accessories because it makes it very uniquely uh, unique uh, very individual kind of style and I love it I love doing that with all my bags and uh, yeah because you know nowadays you want to have a style that is very different so that you kind of stand out and you know and it turns out that everybody will love what you are carrying so look you see so i turned this into a chain and a leather strap how cool is that right so for all of you 
you out there when you have all those extra straps or chains on the bags that you own and you don't use them and you would you know think about you know throwing them away or giving them away do keep in mind that you can play around with all these items at a later date because you never know when something interesting pops out and you know you get to you know do some creative imaginative kind of fashion style so all right so that's it for this bag and uh, this wallet and wallet on chain let's go on to another one so what do we have now that uh, i can consider um okay i'm gonna go to my Chanel purchase. So all these purchases I had done in the last two to three months, I was scouring on the pre-love market for it. And this Chanel baby is, um, I think she's 18 now and uh, definitely something that I've been eyeing for a long time. I've been keeping my eye out on a Chanel long wallet. So, okay, as usual, you can do this. And for this wallet, I would actually love to have it with the pearls because we all know that you know um, Chanel and you know with the crepe they, they love all the pearls in the heat the latest season and um, they are absolutely stunning Chanel and pearls go hand in hand absolutely stunning and yeah so I'm gonna pair this baby with the pearl and. She only cost me probably a tenth of the price if you were to buy a new wallet on chain by Chanel. Okay, so look, isn't it gorgeous? Yeah, I love it, I love it. So, yeah, <laughs> I've got one here, this pretty, pretty one. Okay, so before I left, um, you know, um, before I kind of like left the thought of making, you know, converting all my wallet on chains, my wallets to cha wallet on chains, I wanted to give this Anya Heimark um, wallet a try because um, it looked like it was the same size as a Louis Vuitton Sarah wallet. So I assumed that you know it could fit and I gave it a try and it actually fits all right so if you have other wallets um, in your collection and you wanted to turn it into a wallet and chain it does not necessarily have to be a LV design or a Chanel long wallet it could be something of a similar size and see she fits so you know i could use this wallet also to use besides um you know so i could use my samoga for basically most of my long wallets so i was very very happy to find that out um and super stoked that i could use um, this beautiful samoga ingenious uh, wallet insert to turn all my wallets into box. So voila guys, here it is. Pretty pretty wallet on chains for you to experiment as well. So I hope you found this video informative and that you will enjoy this whole process as much as I have and I you know I will continue to and explore the beauty of accessorizing your wallet and turning them into wax. So do like this video and subscribe to my channel and do comment down below say yes if you really really enjoyed this video and watched it all the way to the end. Thank you guys and girls and I will see you on the next video that will be on nano bags. Okay? See you guys. Bye!